from Z Money here, and today we are gonna go over my top five dividend stocks right now. So I wanted to post this video for a while, but I've been caught up with work. We've been very busy. As you guys know, I work in healthcare and everything that's going on. Been very busy, as you can tell. You can look at the news. Everyone's panicking. It's a mess, but. I promise I'm gonna get be more consistent with these videos and let's just hop right into it so a term that I will be mentioning in in a little bit I'm gonna go over right now it's a PE ratio of a stock so I have my little note cards here of what I want to say about the different stocks so the PE the PE ratio is the ratio that measures its current share price relevant to the earnings per share that a company makes, right? Okay, so we're gonna ha hop right into it. I, and this is in no order. My first dividend stock we're gonna be talking about is Stag in Industrials. We're gonna put, I'm gonna put a little note on the side here, just so the important factors about it. So Stag Industrial offers a 5% dividend their P.E. ratio is at about 80 right now. Buy-in to get it, the stock right now as I'm making this video, it is $28.80. It's been down. The whole market's been down recently. And this is a perfect buy-in point. So just a little bit about Stag. Stag is a real estate company. It's a REIT, a real estate investment trust. And they focus on single tenant properties in the United States. So that is one of my top five dividend stocks right at the moment. You could buy it for pretty cheap right now and it has a good dividend percentage. So this isn't this is just a little advice. I'm not qualified in any way, but this is what I'm buying and the exactly the dividend stocks that I'm buying right now as we see this market drop because we, it is going to go back up. We are at a great buying point right now and it's, it will go back up. The next one is Realty Income. The ticker symbol is O. And I've been investing in Realty Income for a while now. It has about a 3.8% dividend. Right now the PE ratio is 52. And to buy it in right now, it's $75. Pretty nice buying point for this. It's on sale. Everything's on sale right now, pretty much. It's a nice buying point. I would go snag it up. So, something good about Realty Dividend, it's monthly dividends. So you have that monthly income falling in. We all like that monthly passive income. So Realty Income acquires freestanding commercial properties that generate revenue under long-term leases. They do more maybe like shopping centers, like businesses, commercial properties and that. Next stock I'm going to be talking about is AT&T. Of course, you can't have make a dividend video without the AT&T powerhouse dividend, right? So it's almost at a 6% dividend, 5.9. Its PE ratio right now is 18.6, and its buy-in is $37.20. It's at a nice price for AT&T. It offers a good dividend. AT&T is a telecoms company, and they have they are the second largest provider in mobile services. AT&T also has DirecTV for their television service, and it has multiple streams of income as well another stock that I will mention later. So AT&T everyone. Next, we're gonna go over the ETF. It's the Vanguard Total Stock ETF. Um, ticker symbol is VTI. It has a 1.9% dividend, which isn't the best, but it's an ETF, which is less volatile and you know, you gotta pick and choose here. You won't get the highest dividend, but it's a little bit safer of a stock. So 
So its PE ratio right now is 28, and it's about $156 buy-in right at this moment. So a bit more expensive, more expensive than the other ones I was telling you about. But I think if you want to be a little safer and a little less risky, you can buy into this. So VTI is an ETF, and it tracks the performance of all of the U.S. markets into one index. So it, it's less volatile because instead of having one stock, you have a bunch of companies that it looks at, which is why it's a little more expensive. So you, it takes about 500 companies, and you get a tiny little piece of each one with this ETF. And last but not least, my most profitable stock that I would intend on buying right now is Disney. Disney is at a very low buying point right now. Its buying point is $119 about at this point. And it's a 1.5% dividend, which is not much, but I had to put it on my list because it is a blue chip stock that I'm holding. It is one of my core holdings and it offers, like I said, the 1.5% dividend. It's not that high. It has an 18.8 PE ratio. And just a little bit about Disney. I'm sure everyone knows about Disney. But they have multiple streams of income with their streaming service, Disney Plus. They have their amusement parks all around the world. And they have their movies. They have Marvel and Star Wars and all these movies that they own, all the Disney movies. So they have multiple streams of income. And I think Disney is at a great buying point right now. You got to snag it up while it's on sale. That's what everyone has to think about. When we have these little dips in the market, you just got to think of that everything is on sale and you're getting it for cheaper. You cannot panic and sell everything because then you will just keep losing money. Hold on to what you bought and just purchase more so that you get everything on sale. So that's going to wrap it up, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. My top five dividend stocks. And this is just a little advice, a little just to tell you what I do with my money and how I'm putting it to work for me so I keep building my dividends as they go. I want to keep that passive income flowing and soon I will be doing an updated video on my portfolio. It has grown a bit since I've last shown you guys, so I'm going to keep showing you that. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Please hit that like button for the YouTube algorithm. And I promise I will be uploading more. We're going to try to get to at least one video a week. Hopefully two if I have the time. So thank you. Hit that subscribe button down below. Tell me what you want to see next week. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.